I was diagnosed at age uh, 46, about 10 years ago, and um, I had symptoms of pumping about 15 years before that. So um, I was diagnosed after uh, being very sick for about a year and a half, two years, and being misdiagnosed and undiagnosed with several different co more common things. And I was diagnosed after I fell into respiratory failure because my breathing was so bad. And I was in the hospital at the University of Minnesota for 11 days. And I was kind of a mystery patient at that time. But that um, respiratory failure led to my diagnosis a few months later. And um, from a muscle biopsy? From a muscle biopsy, a second muscle biopsy. The first one, they didn't catch it a year before. Um, and I've pretty much become a really good patient advocate, kind of helping newly diagnosed people um, try to find their way through the journey. Um, I remember when I was first diagnosed, there wasn't Facebook or any social media that they have now, which we have a lot of really good, strong groups in our community on. Um, there was a couple, of, one thing called the GSD net that I found a few other patients on and um, they really helped me learn to navigate insurance and just find the correct doctors to see. And, um, I try to pay it forward as say, help newly diagnosed people um, that we find online that are kind of confused and overwhelmed with everything and just tell them it's going to be okay there's a treatment you should get on and get, you know, it really stabilizes you and just kind of give them some hope and see the light type of thing.